but we're getting ready to go on our trip. I'm hella excited. What's up and welcome back to my channel. I look like a hot mess right now because I went out last night with my friends for my birthday dinner. I don't know if you can hear Alan He's throwing away his food, but we're getting ready to go on our trip. I'm hella excited. I have a bunch of things to do. I went yesterday and I got waxed. So I did like my arms, my legs, my bikini, whatever. So yeah, I did that already because I knew I wouldn't have time today. And I just got home. I just got my lashes done. My lash girl always saves me. She makes me look freaking like I can literally fly away with them. I have an appointment in about 10, 15 minutes to get my nails done because they're bad and i'm also gonna get a pedicure and then later on when i get home we are gonna pack for my trip we're going for eight days so we're doing a seven day cruise it's a saturday to saturday but we are going a day early to florida so that we could just explore we're flying into orlando florida it's so weird because yesterday in orlando the temperature was minus two degrees so i'm a little bit scared it's saying now that it's back up to 24 so i don't know why they just had this like random gush of cold, like, I don't know. I'm hoping tomorrow when we go, it's not like that. But like I said, I need to go get ready because we're going on a trip regardless. So come along with me. Hey guys, we're back in my car and it's still a little bit messy. If you watch my daily vlog, I'm just gonna adjust it a bit. I had some stuff back there. It was a lot. The lighting's a little bit crap, but we are leaving my condo now. Gonna get my nails done. I also remembered that I have to actually go pick up Alan's suit. So with like cruises, they always have two formal nights. So you dress up both of those nights. Like people literally look like they're going to like galas and their proms and crap. We took it to the dry cleaners because the last time he wore it was for a wedding that we went to in October. He told me to pick it up after two o'clock today, which works out because I'm getting my nails done at 1.30. So I'll probably be like an hour at nails. People are probably like looking at my car being like, what is she doing? What is that? Oh well. And I'm just on time for my appointment parked and okay so we're going in we are gonna get these bad boys done i'm getting a shellac manicure and i'm also getting a shellac pedicure so let's go so i'm done at nails they came out so nice i'll show you guys them close up but i'm so dumb because i finished nails and i forgot to pick up alan's suit so now i'm here i just parked and he went inside this is where it is the dry cleaning whatever so he's inside you probably can't see him my nails oh i love them so on my toes i did white shellac and then on my nails i did also white shellac but then i did two that were like marble with gold so look at them oh there's alan coming with his suit so they're just oh my god if it would focus white and then the ring fingers like this black marble with the gold and then i also did the thumb like that don't mind my skin i bite my skin it's really bad so i'm back home need to start packing now just wanted to quickly show you my toenails they're just obviously plain white but they're cute i like them i always do white because i feel like white looks so good with a tan and plus i don't usually wear colored nail polish anyways so yeah we're gonna pack now you guys are gonna help me i need to pack within the next like hour because we are going to sleep at my dad's house tonight we live almost an hour away from the toronto airport and we're not driving there at like 3 a.m so we're sleeping at my dad's house in brampton tonight so that he can drive us to the airport at 4 a.m yay me i don't think i showed you guys but i also got a new luggage it's marble so pretty and then like the logo is like rose gold and then the handles also rose gold well well that's a tongue twister rose gold i can pick it up with ease i think it only weighs like 11 pounds and it's also nice because it has like the rollers at the bottom rollers they're freaking wheels kayla so I can literally just like, I don't know if you're even seeing this, but like it's going to come clutch. So we're going to pack. This is Alan. He's already packed. 
It's ready to go. So we're allowed having 50 pounds, or what is it, 20 kilograms? You're literally- 23 kilograms. Look at the black line, is it below it? Barely. So we're good. So Alan got a new camo uh, luggage, as you can see, black camo, it's really nice. Ours are literally exactly the same, just different patterns. I'm literally gonna try and pack only one outfit for every night because usually I overpack. We're gonna be on the boat for seven days, so I only need seven outfits for dinner. Like, we always dress like nice, like I'll wear like rompers and dresses and stuff, but I end up bringing like 10, 11, 12 things and I don't wear almost half of it, so this trip I'm going to try my hardest to only bring seven. Now I'm gonna pack gym clothes because Alan and I do go to the gym while we're on vacation, so I'm gonna do that now i'm gonna probably bring four to five outfits even though it's a little bit extra but you guys know me i love my gym stuff so that's what we're gonna do next so that was fairly quick i'm bringing literally sets of all my gym clothes because I'm really annoying. Everything is gonna be shorts and sports bras because it's gonna be hot and that's what I wear anyway. So this green sports bra from Elfly with the green matching shorts, the red sports bra, red shorts, and I have a black one with black. I'm probably bringing too much gym clothes. I'm gonna bring this. This is literally my favorite sports bra right now. It is so nice. You've probably seen it in all my Instagram posts with these teal shorts. Am I gonna gym five days out of the week? Probably not, maybe. We do gym a lot, usually at least three times, so. Ask me how many times we gymmed. Once. So I brought all of that, and I only went to the gym one time. Now we're in for the fun part. I'm gonna do my bathing suits right now, and you guys are not gonna believe how many bathing suits I have, so. This is my drawer, and I've actually cleaned this. So I have bathing suits at the top in these packages from Cupshe, but then this whole drawer is bikinis. I'm gonna literally take it out. Bikinis for me are like my gym clothes. I like bringing a lot, and it's honestly because I don't know how I'm gonna feel. Like, do I wanna wear a two-piece? Do I wanna wear a one-piece? Do I wanna show off my booty? Do I wanna have a thong bikini? Do I wanna have more full coverage? Like. I don't know how I'm gonna be feeling. Do I wanna wear a bandeau? Do I wanna wear straps? I don't know. So I always tend to bring like 10 bathing suits probably for a seven day trip, but I've narrowed it down to these. <laughs> Which might, like, it might look like a lot, but it's not. I have this, like, I don't even know what this is. I think you're supposed to put your laundry in this. It's from TNA, as you can see, or Aritzia, whatever. But I've been using this forever for my bathing suits. So I just hold my bathing suits in here. Usually this bag is full to the top. So I'm pretty like, I'm doing a good job. I'm really happy with that. Okay, you guys are probably gonna be like, Kayla, you're insane and this piece of hair is bothering me. But this is what we're working with. Everything on this bed has got to go. So all of my clothes, Gym stuff, bikinis are over there, sleeping stuff. So my sunscreen's in here, tanning oil's in here, shampoo, hairspray stuff, comb, straightener, more toiletry stuff, and then makeup. So we're gonna try and put that all in there. you guys but the shoes I'm bringing I'm bringing one set of heels I'm bringing these white sandals black sandals gold sandals flip-flops and then I'm gonna wear these on the plane my concerts so I'm all packed everything is good it fits we're good we didn't scale it yet should we scale it yeah just under 50 so I'm good all right guys, I think I'm gonna end today's video here because Alan and I are in a rush. We need to get to Brampton. We need to get to my dad's house and we're running late. It's almost six o'clock and honestly, I'm freaking exhausted. We need to be up at like 3 a.m. to go to the airport at 4 a.m. So yeah, we need to get to Brampton. We still have to go get US money. What else do we have to do? Alan still needs a haircut. Like. We're running out of time, so I'm gonna end today's video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I can't wait for you to see our vlog footage from our trip. I literally am so stoked. We have a GoPro, we have my Canon camera, and...
little secret, but we bought a drone. So look out for that vlog footage. I'm gonna have so much when I get back. I'm really hyped, I'm really excited. Thank you guys for watching. Subscribe below, give this video a thumbs up, and I will see you when I'm back.